Okay, hey guys, welcome back. Today we got some more leaks from Kizmo. Uh, he said that we're going to be getting four new guns, which we already knew, but he did release what the four new guns are going to be. So we are getting the AK-12, the MP7, the Sega 12K, and the USP-45. That's um, I'm pretty happy with those weapons, I'm not going to lie. The AK-12 is a assault rifle, the MP7 is a PDW, the Sega 12K is a shotgun, and the USP is a pistol. We are also getting something called the OKP7, which if any of you have played Phantom Forces before, you probably know what that is. Uh, or at least what it looks like. But it's going to have a like new feature in this game. The new feature is going to be that it can be used on guns that don't have the universal rail. So what the universal rail is, is like this rail. It's called a Picatinny rail in real life, but it's what on top of this M110 and the Chris Vector. They all got Picatinny rails on top in the MCX. FAL don't got that. Barrett does, but can't have... Oh wait, no, it can't. The M1 obviously doesn't have that. But this sight will apparently be able to be used on guns that don't have that normal attachment. And they'll like go on the side, as you can see in the pictures. I think that's really cool, because I don't like these irons, if I'm not going to lie. And I don't like these irons either. And someone is coming in A10. I don't really like the FAL or the M1's irons, so it'd be really nice to get some better irons or the full on sight, like any kind of thing like that. I don't know what all they're gonna add. They might add more attachments in the daily rewards. That'd be really cool. But yeah, that's pretty much this, what they said today. This is a really short video, just like giving some more news on what they said. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like and subscribe and goodbye.